I'm originally from New Jersey, but moved up to the Northeast for medical school at Tufts University, and then went on to do my general surgery training at Rhode Island Hospital. I specialize in minimally invasive surgery and bariatric surgery. When I first meet with patients in the office, we typically discuss their diet history. And many, many times people have tried a number of things that have been unsuccessful. What makes surgery different is that it gives you more control over your own body. And typically patients say they can better control their hunger and better follow the diet. Bariatric surgery is a big decision for anyone who's uh, contemplating weight loss surgery. I think a lot of people who are not that familiar with the procedure think it's going to work no matter what, and unfortunately that's not true. You really need to make the time and put in the effort um, to exercise and change probably long-standing patterns of behavior. At the Center for Bariatric Surgery, we have support groups available. Patients receive nutritional counseling both before and after surgery. They typically meet with physical therapists before surgery, and they receive psychiatric evaluations before surgery, uh, as well as some psychological support afterwards if it's required. We really want people to be successful uh, with their weight loss journey. I have a husband and a young daughter, and we love to do things in the Providence area. She loves the Children's Museum, she loves the zoo, going and watching the elephants get showered on the weekend mornings. I find it rewarding to help people through the challenge of weight regain. The opportunity to help people lose weight when they've struggled with health problems for many years is very personally satisfying. <laughs>